What's up, Treasure Xers? Toy Insanity here, and this is Treasure X Tuesday, episode 13. Doing seven treasure blocks today. Let's get them looked. We've got a map and a checklist lined up right here. Okay, so at the end of 12, I mentioned there's only five left that we're looking for. But I forgot to mention that in, believe it or not, episode 11, I got another figure missing parts. So, and it was, of course, the one figure in that episode that would have been a new figure, a new character. Scurvy Gold Bags. So this is only the second one overall that was missing parts. Scurvy Gold Bags was missing his torso. Of all things, he's missing his torso, and he also had two, let's see, right arms. So even if the torso had been included, it still would have been a messed up figure. So, the end result means I'm still looking for six. Scurvy Gold Bags, Gold Gills, Golden Star, Julius Caesar. We did last week get King Gold Crown, who is uh, you know, confirmed exclusive to Series 1 Wave 2. We're looking for Golden Spear, and we have gotten Blingy the Kid, the other Series 1 Wave 2 character, and then we're looking for boop, 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 boop. It's Pharaoh Loot Loot. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Hopefully we get some of them today. All seven are confirmed. Well, believed to be confirmed, Series 1, Wave 2. What we've discovered for a couple weeks now, the Series 1, Wave 1 packs just have double-sided tape sticking on a piece of paper giving you this advice. And the paper is larger. And like I said, it's just a piece of paper stuck on there, double-sided tape. This is a sticker. There's adhesive all the way around it, and it's smaller. But when you see, when you buy one, you open one, and you see the sticker, that's wave two. When you see the piece of paper, that's wave one. I'll remind you the gimmick on the coin and the map. Because remember, there's ten layers of fun. Orient it upright. Look for the icons. We've got a pine tree on the right. I think that's a house on the bottom. And a tower, like a turret, on the left. Coming over here, you want to look for the gold objects and find those three other iconic silhouettes around there. Is it you? Nope. Is it you? Nope. It is you. The tree, the tower, the home. So we are now, it says down here, on the march for the Golden Eagle Crest. Which we do have, and I think that that belongs to the Golden Gladiators. So we're going to get one of these three Golden Gladiators. Hopefully it is Julius Caesar, because that's the one we're missing. And it is. Excellent. Gosh, man. <laughs> Man, I was so uh, excited to call that one. The weapons are similar. I was trying to call it on the weapon. That is the weapon of Brutus Blingus, not Julius Caesar. But we have Brutus Blingus, I think, five or six times now. Let's check out his treasure to see if we get that Golden Eagle Crest. And no, uh, we get the bronze horn. Alright, Brutus Blingus is our first treasure block of episode 13. Back to Toy Falls. Treasure block 2. Let's 
So I'm not going to do the coin on the rest. I just like to do it one time as a reminder. Who we got? Who we got? Who we going to get? Got? Man, Dr. Goldsville. It's either him or Rogue Goldsnatcher that I have the most times overall. This is good at least. Except I do have this one too. Alright, we're getting the gold dipped object with Dr. Goldspell today. Which is the scarab, right? Why did I say that? It's the gold idol. Let me think for a second. Yeah, we have the gold idol also. Dr. Goldspell has brought us the gold dipped object known as the gold idol. All right, that's number two. Episode 13, treasure block number three. This is going to be Gold Blade. So far, not only have they all been duplicates, but they've all been ones that were also in Wave 1. Opening the treasure right now for Gold Blade. Which, of course, is the glow in the dark. Hello Kitty. Meow. They call it the Jade Luck Cat. Treasure block four. Excellent. Yes. You see what just rolled out? This is Golden Star. And I have watched the cartoons. I basically never mentioned that but he turns out to be a bad guy in the cartoons so check out the little webisodes the little animated cartoons there's a group of them searching for the treasures they kinda of work as infinity stones each treasure grants them magical abilities and then there's a group of you know, bad skeletons teamed up together. And, uh, Golden Star is one of those guys. I'll show you his weapon, too. It's kind of a unique weapon. Cool looking scythe. Golden Star, weapon, head, and treasure so if you've seen the little webisodes they're a group of the skeletons are teamed up with a child you know the chosen one a human a non-skeletal human and my question is do you think that they'll ever make that little human guy into a figure this is called the Ming vase Treasure number 14, 
the Ming vase. Excellent. We got Golden Star. That was block number four. I'll open five down here. Treasure X Tuesday, episode 13, treasure block number five. What is this? What is this? I don't recognize that weapon. Scuba scavengers, we're getting gold gills. Excellent, another new one. Let me rinse his head off for you. Gold gills. Another new treasure. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? The sacred giant pearl. Something an old gold gills was happy to have found and maintains as his own. Alright, we got two more. Blah 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 blah. I'm gonna grab them both. We're gonna go back to the sunny spot. Down here. All right. Wrapping up Treasure X Tuesday, episode 13. Smash that like button. Thank you very much. <laughs> yes. Finally, three in a row, new ones. Let me grab that checklist. So, this is Golden Spear. Yes! Golden Spear, episode 13, block 6. Here's his weapon. Similar to uh, Chief Goto's, but his serrations are going the other way. Golden Spear. The treasure that comes with Golden Spear is something silver. A silver snake? That guy is not only new, but he's super cool. Silver Serpent. Very nice. Alright, we got block seven. I just mentioned this guy, huh? Chief Goldo. It's his weapon. All right. Got three new ones this episode. The treasure that comes with Chief Goldo is the Jade Mask. Added to the Toy Sanity Collection, the Treasure X Tuesday Collection today, Gold Gills, Golden Star, Golden Spear. We still need to get Julius Caesar, 
Jackal Goldstaff. And I have to replace Scurvy Golbez. Complete, complete. Need Julius Caesar. Complete, complete, complete. Need Jackal Goldstaff. So assuming those three that we got today are complete. Assuming the three new ones we got today are not also missing pieces like Scurvy Goldbags, missing his torso, and also possessing two of the same arm, then that leaves only Julius Caesar, Jackal Goldstaff, and the Scurvy Goldbags replacement. And I wasn't sure if I was going to whip it out. But I'm doing a bonus. Doing eight today. Secret bonus. Come on, be one of those three. One of those three. One of those three. One of those three. Who's that fat sword? This is Captain Goldeye, isn't it? Not a new one, but I'm sure he's a fan favorite. So instead of seven, we ended up doing eight today, but we got three new ones. Three new figures, leaving only three, since I have to replace one with missing pieces. Crystal Eyeball, which is supposed to be clear, but it's obviously tinted pinkish, reddish color. Alright guys, this has been Treasure X Tuesday, episode 13. We did 8 treasure blocks next week. I might do 8, I might go and do 9. Hopefully rounding out this series. Because like I said, 3 times now, just need to get Julius Caesar. Not Jack of Gold stuff, I did say that wrong. I'm glad I'm reviewing now since I said something wrong. I need Julius Caesar, Pharaoh Loot Loot, and a replacement, Scurvy Gold Bags. I'm Twin Sanity. Thank you for your subscription. Thank you for viewing. Smash that like button, and I'll see you next Tuesday.